it's Christmas Eve. So much to do and so little time. So, it's Christmas Eve and I decided to be the hostess that's doing the most, so. I decided to pull out this old wig because I am not even gonna try to do my hair today. My natural hair, nope, it's in cornrows going back. So I'm gonna do my hair, do my face. I have to cut some bangs into this wig because the lace is a no. And then I have to start cooking or prepping to cook for tomorrow. So I already wrapped Christmas gifts, so that's out of the way, but I do have to cook. I'm cooking a lot, so I'm excited. Christmas is tomorrow, the kids are ready, family's coming over, and I'm gonna host Christmas for the first time, so that should be fun. I've been having some acne problems, so today I'm using the Murad Clarifying Cleanser. This is their acne line. And the blemishes are blemishing, so I'm gonna try and use this today and then do some light makeup and then get to work. some major breakouts lately because I got my period TMI but whatever I haven't had one in like a year and a half breastfeeding and they decided to come along and kick my butt so now that it's over I've got to get rid of all these acne scars so this is a acne treatment I wish it had like a pump or something but it doesn't I'm just gonna put this all over my face And then I'm gonna go in with their Rapid Relief Acne Spa Treatment just to get the big blemishes because I tend to break out more on my cheeks and on my forehead. And then I'm going to use the Murad Vitamin C Brightening Serum. I just do like two, three pumps there and then rub it all in. I'm gonna use the Sunday Riley's Vitamin C Brightening Cream just for a little bit of extra moisturizer. It's a thick cream. It comes with a little spatula and I just put it across my face, on my nose, chin, cheeks, and forehead, and then rub that in. It's gonna be really, really cold in South Carolina, like 18 degrees or something. I know it's like not as cold as most people get, but for me, coming from San Diego, where we don't get cold like this, it's cold. So we're planning on staying in today and tomorrow and just getting fat. <laughs> now I'm gonna put on my lip treatment. I've been using the Burt's Bees Overnight Intense Lip Treatment. I usually use it overnight, but I didn't use it last night, so I'm gonna use it right now, just as a prep for my makeup. And then I'm gonna go ahead and do some light makeup. Ah, this just makes my lips feel so buttery smooth. And everything just makes my skin look glowy, so. I'm going with Mirror to Burt's Bees, so. I'm gonna do some light makeup and then cut these bangs on this wig because this wig is looking a little crazy. school for personal reasons I didn't finish but I feel like it's time for me to start getting back into doing hair and makeup and all of that stuff so this is my year to get back into that so I washed this yesterday it feels really nice 
just the lace isn't all that good. I probably should have bleached the knots. I just didn't feel like it. But I've had it for like two years and have not really used it. I only use it for like photo shoots and stuff. But I decided to cut bangs in it so I can actually wear it. But I didn't do them all that well yet. I just basic bangs, but I'm gonna go in and finish cutting them. I still have my shears from cosmetology school back in what, 20, 2014, 2015? <laughs> so I'm gonna go in and finish cutting this wig. I haven't cut hair in so long, this is crazy. I wanna shorten it. It's a good length for the middle. Yeah, that's so much better. Might not be the best bangs, but hey. But yeah, that's it. It's cute. I'm gonna put mascara on, and then I am going to go prep for Christmas dinner. So yeah, let me stop feeling myself and get to the kitchen. <laughs> Currently defrosting the ham. No, the burners are not on. It's just in a pot of water. I didn't have a pot big enough, so I'm defrosting the ham, defrosting the chicken because I'm gonna make jerk chicken, and I'm also going to make fried chicken, honey glazed fried chicken. And then I'm going to go ahead and prep the yams for tomorrow. I'm gonna slice some sweet potatoes, and I'm also gonna make a sweet potato pie. So I might make the sweet potato pie today. Um, the rest of the stuff I can make tomorrow, but I just wanted to prep some of this stuff now, get it out of the way so that, so that I have less work to do tomorrow. a good sweet potato pot condensed milk cream cheese if you don't have those two you're missing out add them try it it'll make your sweet potato pies taste amazing Thank you. 